Hello everyone, I'm Jake, the Geek Out Tech. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Finder tabs in Mavericks. And if you enjoy this video, please hit the like button because it really helps me out. I'm sure most of you are familiar with how tabs work in general, especially if you've used a browser that's come out in the last couple of years. Now with Finder, instead of having a window for each folder, you'll have one window with a tab for each folder. So let's get this set up and see how it works. First we'll need to open a Finder window by clicking on Finder in the dock. On a quick side note, if you want a new window to open with something other than all my files, just go to Preferences and right here you can select a new location. I'm going to select a desktop because that's the place I most commonly go to. By default, Finder and Mavericks has tabs turned off. To turn this on, click on View in the menu bar and select Show Tab Bar. With the tab bar, you can add more tabs by clicking on File and selecting New Tab. You can use the shortcut Command and T, or you can click on the plus over here on the right side. Just like in a browser, you can do a lot of rearranging with the tabs. You can reorder the tabs by clicking and dragging them, and you can drag a tab outside the window to open that tab in a new window. You can also do the same thing by clicking on the tab and then selecting Window and Move Tab to New Window. You can drag tabs from one window to another. And you can merge all your windows by selecting Window and Merge All Windows. If you have multiple tabs open, you can move to the next tab to the right by pressing Ctrl and Tab on the keyboard, and you can move to the tab on the left by pressing Ctrl, Shift, and the Tab key. And to close a tab, just hover the cursor over the tab for the X to appear and click it, or you can use the shortcut Command and W. Also, several of the options I've already spoken about are accessible by right-clicking or control-clicking the tab itself. Now to open a folder in a new tab, hold down Command and double-click the folder, or right-click on the folder and select Open in New Tab. For me, the best part of having tabs in Finder is how easy it makes it to move files or folders around. Just navigate to a file or folder you want to move in the first tab, then open a second tab and navigate to where you want to move or copy the file or folder. Now, just click and drag the file or folder over to the tab to move it. Or you can hold down the Option key and click and drag the file or folder to copy it. When the file is being copied, you should see a little plus symbol. So if you're the type of person who uses multiple Finder windows at the same time, Tabs is a great way to make Finder much more manageable. I'm Jake, the Geek Out Tech. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Don't forget to hit that like button. Follow me on Twitter, and I'll see you next time.